Hey guys, Christina Garibaldi here, and welcome to Us Weekly's Bachelor Trivia, a weekly trivia game to test Bachelor Nation's knowledge. Now, before we get started on this week's trivia game, we have to give a shout out to last week's viewer, Violetta Cannon, who got seven out of 10 right. Not so bad at all. It definitely was a tough one. So great job. Please keep commenting and let us know how you did each and every week. Now, before we get started, we of course want to remind you how the game works. We will give you 10 questions and 10 seconds to lock in your response. Today's theme is all about our leading man, Matt James, and his ladies. So get those roses ready. Here is your very first question. So last week, one of the leading ladies, Kit Keenan, broke up with Matt, saying that she didn't have the clarity she needed before her hometown date. If we had gone to Kit's hometown, who is her fashion designer mom that we would have met? Was it A, Betsy Johnson, B, Donna Karen, C, Cynthia Raleigh, D, Diane von Furstenberg? If we had gone to Kit's hometown, who is her fashion designer mom that we may have met? Well, the correct answer is C, Cynthia Raleigh. If you check out Cynthia's Instagram, then you will find a ton of gorgeous pics of her daughter Kit rocking her colorful looks. Question number two, Matt James calls Raleigh, North Carolina home, but what big city can you find him in now? Is it A, Chicago, B, New York, C, Los Angeles, or D, Washington, DC? Matt James calls Raleigh, North Carolina home, but what big city can you find him in right now? Well, the answer is B, New York. And rumor has it he lives with bestie Tyler Cameron on the Lower East Side. All right, moving right along to question number three. In a recent interview with Us Weekly, what did Matt say he learned about himself during his bachelor journey? A, that he's capable of love. B, that he's capable of opening up to new people. C, that he's not afraid of heights or D, that he's learned to find the good in bad situations. In a recent interview with Us Weekly, what did Matt say that he learned about himself during his bachelor journey? That I'm capable of loving, you know? Yes, you heard the man. The answer is A, that he's capable of love. So does that mean that Matt found love? Well, we'll just have to wait a few more weeks to find out. All right, question number four. Matt James picked his final four ladies this week. Which lady is the youngest? Is it A, Rachel, B, Michelle, C, Serena P, or D, Brie? Matt James picked his final four ladies this week. Which lady is the youngest? Well, the correct answer is C, Serena P. The publicist told Matt that she was falling in like with him at just 22 years old. Well, Matt James is, of course, extremely athletic. If you've checked out his Instagram, then you know that he is often playing sports totally shirtless. We're not complaining at all. But which sport did he play in college? Was it A, basketball, B, football, C, golf, or D, surfing? Which sport did Matt James play in college? Well, the answer is B. Matt played wide receiver at Wake Forest University, where he met recent bachelor runner-up Tyler Cameron, who was quarterback on the team. All right, next question. Before the show aired, Matt sat down with Us Weekly and revealed why shooting The Bachelor was tough for him. What was his reason for this? Was it A, he had a hard time choosing his final rose pick? B, he didn't like any of the ladies at first? C, he had never seen the show before, or D, it was hard talking about his personal life on camera. Why was shooting The Bachelor hard for Matt James? Uh, it's tough because there's a lot of things that I've avoided in my personal life. Well, as Matt said, the correct answer is D. It was very hard for him to be vulnerable and open about his personal life on camera, which we totally get. All right, next up, Michelle Young is one of Matt's final four ladies. When she's not going on dates on national television, what does the 27-year-old do for a living? Is she A, a social media expert, B, a photographer, C, an elementary school teacher, or D, a social worker?
What does Michelle Young do for a living? Well, the correct answer is C. She is an elementary school teacher. According to her show bio, the Minnesota native focuses on preparing her students to be the next generation of community leaders. All right, moving right along, Matt James started an organization called ABC Food Tours with his buddy Tyler Cameron. What is the mission of this nonprofit business? Is it A, teaching underprivileged children basketball? B, teaching people how to date? C, creating experiences for underprivileged kids? Or D, providing health care to those in need? What is the mission for Matt James's nonprofit business, ABC Food Tours? Well, that answer is C. Matt and Tyler create experiences for New York City students who are facing challenges in food insecurity and adversity at home. We definitely love a guy who gives back. All right, we are nearing towards the end, so get ready for the next question. Before the season, Matt was shown on TikTok with Tyler Cameron and another Bachelor Nation favorite. Who was he seen with? Is it A, Madison Pruitt? B, Hannah Ann Sluice, C, Hannah Brown, or D, Kelly Flanagan. Who is Matt James seen with on TikTok with his buddy Tyler Cameron? Well, if you were following along with the quarantine crew, then you know the answer is C, Hannah Brown. Tyler and Matt and Hannah went viral on TikTok as they were quarantining together in Florida in the beginning of lockdown. All right, we made it to our final question, question number 10. Brie opened up in last week's episode about how she left her dream job so that she could stay on her journey to find love on The Bachelor this week. What did Brie do for a living? Was it A, a communications manager, a B, financial manager, C, a professional ballerina, or D, nurse? What did Brie do for a living before she made an appearance on The Bachelor? Well, the correct answer is A. The San Francisco native is a communications manager at a prominent tech company. So if it doesn't work out with Matt Brie, I hope they hire you back. Would you guys leave your job to find love? Let us know in the comments and please tell us how you did in this week's quiz. We will see you guys every Monday at 2 p.m. Keep commenting, keep subscribing, and we will see you guys next week.